so Matt's going to demonstrate the application for us and um, show us what it does for him. Okay, it's all yours, Matt. Off all right, go. so starting off on uh, with the application here on the, on the tablet, click on the device just to open it up. First screen we're going to see here is uh, my schedule screen. So be able to look throughout the week and see what I have planned out for the week. and. Uh, Swiping back and forth to kind of see exactly uh, what accounts I have planned to go see, and uh, what's nice here, you're going to see um, that each of the uh, little little logos next to each of the accounts uh, symbolize something different. We have glasses, and we also have bottles. The glasses actually uh, are, are, are correlating to accounts that are on-premise accounts or bars and restaurants, uh, places that you'll actually consume the alcohol there. And then the bottles are actually grocery stores and liquor stores, something you'll take with you. So if we were uh, to go ahead and just click on one of these guys here to open up the account, whoops. There we are. What it's going to show us right off the bat here is the account profile page. So uh, it has everything in there from uh, my contacts at the account, uh, my, my appointments, uh, when the last time I was in there, uh, those quality surveys that I uh, so so happily like to refer to, uh, making sure the beer tastes the way it should. <laughs> and then also uh, notes and then uh, photographs that we can take in the accounts as well. Um, not to mention a snapshot of what, uh, what their volume looks like uh, and, and a ranking for that uh, particular account. Um, What's great about this as well uh, is that you can go ahead and click in on each one of these to go ahead and add a, add a new appointment, a quality survey. Um, very, very user friendly. I mean, it's, it, it's incredibly easy to use. Um, so just coming through, you can go ahead and set up an appointment. We'll just go ahead and do it for today here at 9 o'clock in the morning. Click save on it, and it's already saved into the into the application. So, um, some other great functionality that we have in here as well is, uh, let's say I was at this uh, account called the Affy Tapple, and I wanted to uh, go visit another account that's uh, relatively close to it. I'm going to go ahead and swipe up on the bottom here and click on the mapping function here, and it's going to bring up all of the accounts that are rel relatively close to Affy Tapple in the area. So, this is just, I mean, it has, like I said, has has taken so much. Uh, so much time out of my day as far as administrative tasks are concerned by, by having something that is so easy to use. Is there, is there um, some mileage perhaps in, in having these accounts here that are all marked, right? Um, connected to some sort of routing system, perhaps? Would that, I mean, would that work for you? Absolutely. It's just an I, idea. That's Absolutely. Probably the next generation. Exactly. Right. So, so something we're definitely working on for, for down the road. Right, okay. And w what about the photographs? What purpose do those serve in the context of this? So, you know, that, that, can, that can work in a, in a lot of different ways. So if we go ahead and, and, and scroll back over here, um, in, in, in different accounts, when we do different events or, you know, any, anything of that nature, it, it, it's always nice to kind of capture that, you know, in, in a photographic form to come back and, and show uh, that particular contact at that account. If it happens to become a new manager at that account, you can say, hey, listen, this is what we did last year that worked really, really well. Here's some pictures of an event that we did, and this is how successful it was. You know, not only on the you know the volume side of things can you show them that, but the photographs also show it. You know, give give that person a visual aspect of exactly what was going on. So. And that's right. another aspect of not only just the quality control that can go back to, to the corporate office, but also from the sharing perspective that you can now post to a social site and provide again that kind of raving fans like atmosphere and culture that uh, New Belgium will breed with their customer base. Absolutely. And what about the, um, the the synchronization back to the CRM system? How how does that work? So right now that's probably better for me. So right now that's a, a live connection over over the wire to them. Phase two will be able to have an offline component. So again, they can do the work when they're not in a uh, not in a position where the connection is uh, solid, mm -hmm. and then be able to synchronize back to the organization. Okay. But those are architecture decisions that make the most sense for their particular organization, and you make the best choice. The other thing I wanted to highlight as we're working with Matt and certainly with devices is we want to be as uh, touch friendly and as iconic, you know, make sure that the experience, the look, the feel works well for, for the user and for the device itself. Okay. Best app you've ever used, Matt? I would have to say so. Wish I would have gotten it sooner. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks very much indeed. Thank you. Thanks, Dev. Thanks, Dev.